You hear me? Let's see here. I am, let's see if I have options on this thing. Oh, I can uh, turn my camera around. Let's see if you guys can see me. What's up guys? I got my laptop over here so I can uh, be up to date on your comments and whatnot. Here, so I can uh, be up to date on your comments. I need to mute it. There we go. So I can watch your, this way I can watch your comments guys. And uh, that way it won't, it won't be, I don't know if that's gonna be easier or harder. If you guys ever gone live on here yourselves, it like shows up on your screen. And uh, I don't know if there's a delay but it sounded like there's a good, I don't know, 10 second delay or so from what I am seeing on the screen to what, yep, I'd say about five second delay. All right, cool guys. First off, all I wanted to do is tell you guys, uh, thank you so much. Uh, it's, been, it's been awesome. The, the turnout on the, the merch sales has, has been incredible. A lot bigger and better than what I actually thought. Um, like, I mean, look, I have a whole bunch of stuff here, guys. I'm, I'm going through all these right now. And uh, every one of you, it's, it's a humbling experience to put something out there and then you guys actually enjoy it so much that you like want to buy my merchandise. That's, it's kind of crazy. I know uh, my daughter, she's in the other room. She doesn't believe it at all. So she's, thinks it's just uh, a fun little hobby that I've been doing. I'm actually really uh, trying to, I don't know, make this into a new business, a new career, a new uh, lifestyle for me. So I, I definitely want this to be something big and support my gambling. <laughs> What's up, Taco Life? Hello. <laughs> All right, guys. So we have over 100 people on here. That's crazy. I, I, was, telling, uh, I was telling Cody if I got a... A hundred, I would be excited. So um, let me take a look at some of your comments here. And let's see. Looks like you guys are liking that truck. Yeah, the truck is a long bed. Uh, it's a work truck. You know, it's, it's. Uh, I don't know, guys. I, I, I know the short bed is the way to go on a lot of that stuff, but it just, it looks so good to me. Uh, I, I really do like the long bed. I actually loaned that truck out to Side by Side Blog and they have been really upset that I'm selling it because they really wanted me to give it back to them. Um, and the other odd thing was that, it, like I said, it was in a, a small accident before. I say small um, because it was just cosmetic in the front and that's why I cleaned it up so much. And a cool thing, shortly after this video, guys, I'm going to be... Um, putting on a NOS kit. That'll be like a first time thing for me. So real quick, uh, since you guys are all tuned in, I got a lot of people on here. Let's take a look at the new merch. All right, so that's the new Bull Chat shirt here. I think you guys are liking that. I mean, how could you not? How cool is this? We have the uh, heat waves on Mr. Bull Chat there. <laughs> that's pretty funny, right? Uh, and like I said, I, I'll be going after anybody who tries to copy this. <clears throat> this one's really, really awesome. I'm really proud of this one. A little history on this, guys. I saw that Sam uh, didn't have a shirt or anything yet. Well, I didn't know he actually had some in production. He actually has some other ones too. So I just went ahead and got together with Chris over at Prime and designed this with them and said, uh, can you guys just make him a cool design that he can use for whatever he wants? And I snagged that picture of the 55 Chevy that he's building uh, and he absolutely loved it. So, um, and I came up with that saying as well, Sam's still shining. I just think at 78 years old, that's a pretty cool thing. You know, there's so many meanings to that saying, Sam's still shining. I think uh, he's a pretty cool dude. Um, he's super excited about all this stuff too. And I told him I'm gonna be giving away some of his stuff in this little video that we're doing right now. Some of his stuff over here. And uh, uh, he was excited about that. He's actually shipping direct, guys. So he's shipping direct from his house. So um, he will have all this stuff separate. So if you ordered stuff like this, 
uh, some of his stuff in particular, it'll come directly from him. And then everything else I have at one shipping location. So that'll come from a different shipping location, the shirts and the heat waves and everything else. These ones here are actually, these ones are mine, um, but because I, I gave away all my other ones. These ones say uh, Cletus on the side. I'm not selling those, I'm just selling the normal uh, ones. And uh, I just love these. These are just such a well-rounded sunglass, sunglasses. And uh, let's see, I'm gonna be giving these away. And these, and guys, look how cool these ones are for that like 70s. It's like such a, um, I don't know, like the side of a square body Chevy. I just love that look. All right, and oh, also, this pair right here, guys, I might as well show you. I was gonna give these away and I, I'm still gonna do it, but I noticed that there was a little flaw in them. These are the, actually, these are actually Garrett's. He gave them to, actually, I stole them. Let's just be honest. I stole these from him. And see, there's like a little bit of a, a flaw right down in here. I don't know if you guys can see it. There it is, see? It's out of the uh, sight line, but I can see why they have them. There's a little spot right there too. So I felt bad about that, but I still think you guys want them. So I'm gonna throw in a hundred bucks with whoever gets, whoever wins these ones. I was, I had these given away before, but I, it was a friend of mine and he's like, oh man, just give them away to another like fan, I guess. So put those in there. Let's just shove that in there right now. I don't think I put it in there yet. That'd be funny. That would be very typical of me to double stack it with a couple hundred bucks. All right. All right, good. You got the heat waves, somebody just said. That's cool. Um, the, uh, the, the heat waves, yeah, they're, they're, a lot, they're discounted. And uh, the cool thing, guys, is heat wave doesn't restrict me on how much I can discount these. So, you know, down the road and some other stuff when I get different models in, I'll be able to have like really cool sales and stuff on my website. And then these ones, I'll show you. A funny thing is, is I just uh, talked my way into getting a sponsorship with Heatwave. I just said, I'm gonna start promoting you and saying that you guys are sponsoring me. And uh, that way you guys will just sponsor me. And it worked. <laughs> so uh, they sent me a whole bunch of stuff to give away and uh, now I'm actually a vendor of theirs, which is like the first vendor account I have. Well, I guess them and Sam. Um, so those are, those are really nice. There's nothing wrong with those ones. Okay. Let's give something away real quick. All right, guys, I'm going to pay attention to the chats and let's give something away and then I'll show you some of this other stuff. All right. Um, I have some trivia. All right. This one's, first one's gonna be easy, and I don't know which one to look at first, if I can, if it's the same time on my computer. Um, I think it is, yeah. All right, guys, the first person to, to type this in the comment section is very easy. What model of Tesla did I drive underwater? First person to write it in the chat log will win this set of glasses. All right, let's see. Ooh, that went crazy. I gotta go back. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> oh, that went crazy, hold on. Let's see, someone got in there. Let's see who it was. Hold on, all right. Nope, not three, not an S. And Joseph Arison. All right, Joseph. Uh, Joseph, reach out to me at uh, Chillin' with Chet. Um, Oh no, that's not it. Let's see. I'm Uncle Chet at gmail.com. Reach out to me at I'm Uncle Chet at gmail.com and uh, send me some sort of proof that that is you. Uh, maybe an email, your address, or something like that. And I'll make sure to uh, add your address and stuff in there and I'll get these shipped off to you. Okay, guys? That's kind of how we're going to do it. Um, if you're a real skis bag, you could probably try to imitate, em emulate somebody and get on here um, and just say I won. Please don't do that. If you won, email me. I'm Uncle Chet 
at gmail.com and uh, I'll make sure to get this to you. All right, let's see. I have another real cool thing here. So here's a whole list of all the people that have purchased. Of This was just the other day. Okay, so I am going to, I told you guys, I got pretty good odds. This seems like a lot, but it's really, it's really not a tremendous amount. What I'm gonna do is just drop my pen and then whatever name that falls on, that's who wins. All right, so this person here, hard for me to read. Let's see. Jordan, J-O-R-D-O-N, Volek, V-O-L-E-K, in Beecher. Looks like Beecher is the town. You spent... $85, so I don't know what you got. Maybe you got a bundle or something. Uh, you win, refund back. I marked it in here, so I'll be reaching out to you. I have your email, and uh, we'll go on from there. Let's do another fun one with you guys, since you guys are all tuned in here. Um, this is a fun one. Let me go back down and get caught up. This is another easy one, guys. So first person to ride in there um, is, am I really Cletus's uncle? <laughs> All right, G12, or 412G35, you are the first one. No, I am not his uncle. G 412G35. All right, that's not Chris, is it, with Prime? Anyways, uh, and if I know you and you win, I don't care, you, you win. This is just for fun. This is not a part of my sweepstakes thing that I have to follow all those rules. So yeah, guys, um, Garrett is not my nephew. I, uh, I don't know. I never even called myself his uncle. Uh, Jack Stan Jimmy, he named me Uncle Chet. Gosh, it was on a, it was on a road week, race week. It was up in uh, Great Bend. We're just hanging out. And it was the first time I went with them on one of those, uh, those events. And I don't know, he just came up with that out of nowhere. I said, dude, come on, Uncle Chet. And then it just really, really stuck. So uh, ever since then, I've kind of messed around with you guys and said that, uh, uh, no, I'm not his grandpa. And no, I'm not his uncle. <laughs> he calls me a boomer all the time when I like make jokes that he doesn't like. He hates uh, the reface stuff that I do. <laughs> it's mainly because he never looks good in it and I make fun of him all the time. But I mean, we all need friends like that, right? We all need friends to, to bust our balls and uh, really give it to us. Cause I think if you're not being made fun of and uh, not be given nicknames in your group, um, are you really part of the group? Are you really a, a, really a friend there? So um, yeah, I am not Garrett, AKA Cletus McFarland's uncle. Sorry to tell you guys all that. All right, let's do another one. Oh, what did, what did he win? Let me see what he won. I'm gonna give him, I'm gonna give him the sticker pack, but I'm also, I thought, you know what, that's just $6, right? Pretty cheap though, but compared to everybody else, I'll throw in a $100 bill with that too. So our, our boy, uh, whoever that winner was, I will need to go back and write that down. Uh, definitely send me an email at um, imunclechat at gmail.com and we'll get that sent out to you. Okay, let's see here. Let's give these away. These are really cool. These are um, some heat waves. These are more traditional look. I think you guys, Probably like these. I, I think I sell a version of these on my website. So the first person to respond, let's do this again. Uh, what is my favorite alcoholic drink? <laughs> let's see. Nope, not Bush. Let's see. I got to go back up here. It starts to flow through and I can't. Uh, vodka, nope, nope, nope. I'm gonna go with uh, Christian. It's just spelled out Christian, lowercase. He said Jack, I'm gonna go with that. That is Jack and, it's technically Jack and Coke, but I will just drink straight Jack as well. So I'm gonna write your name down here. So I, I don't have to search for all these afterwards. All right, Christian, email me at I'm Uncle Chet and like show me how, uh, that, you know, prove that it's you and I will get you these sent off. These are, these are the actual ones. If I don't have a box, I apologize. 
um, but they will come in in the soft case. Um, I had to take them out of the box and those got tossed. So these ones are yours, Christian. Okay, uh, here's another one. I'll do another fun one for you guys. Let's see here. I'm gonna give, uh, let's give this away, hold on. This is kind of cool. Well, kind of cool, it's really cool. All right, I can't really get it in there. This is that poster. There you go, it says Ludacris Speed. And then it's got the uh, plaid at the bottom. I love that wrap, by the way. If it wasn't in pieces in a, a tin can, I would have that rewrapped right away. I took it off actually to take it to a Tesla dealer to have work done and we all know how that went. Okay, so <clears throat> on the video that I drove underwater, the first person to respond will win this poster and uh, I can sign it for you. I can send you this actual one or whatever. I'll sign it um, and I'll throw in, um, I'll throw in a hundred bucks at this too. So this one here is uh, how many views do I have on the submarine one? Hint, it's the, my top viewed video. How many views do I have? First person to write it in the comments, you'll win. All right, Cameron. Cameron, is that Cameron Sinner? Cameron Sinner, one million. Yeah, I know guys, it should be a lot more than that. <laughs> All right, Cameron Center. All right, hit me up on I'm Uncle Chet at gmail.com and I will get that sent out to you, a poster and a hundred bucks. Thank you for hanging out and answering that question. Um, let's see, poster, let's see, black frame. And uh, that pair was there for the, uh, yeah, I'll figure it out. Okay. I just got to stay like uh, organized because uh, after this video is done, then I'll forget. So, okay. All right. The next thing that I will do here is let's get Sam involved. Let's, Let's do this. On my website right now, you buy two, you get one free. I don't know anywhere else. There's not many places. So sorry, Garrett. Sorry, Cletus. I got a smoking deal going right now. Buy two, get one free. It's like basically you put two in the cart and then your third one you put in the cart. The cheapest one will be free on my website at Chillin' with Chet. And uh, let's do another raffle because that's fun. I didn't think of doing this many, but I will do that. Uh, another one on the views. My last video that... Um, came out, how many views did I have? Put it in the comments and the first person. All right, somebody wrote, hold on. Seventy-eight, seventy-five, seventy-six. 76. I got, you gotta have K at the front there, Tom. I don't know if that was right. Am I, am I messed up here? Because I think it's, let me go back to it real quick. I had it written, written down at 76. So I'm pretty sure that somebody said that. Let's see. Oh, it is 78. Okay, 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 okay. It is 78. Sorry, I wrote that down wrong. Maybe I went up two just from the last refresh. <laughs> I hope, I hope, right? Let's see, so let's go back to that and I'll look at my chat log. And I know somebody said that for sure. Let's see. Oh, dang it, it kicked me out of that. And it, it, when I logged out of that, it took me away from, oh, here we go, here we go, here we go, I got it. I have two uh, windows open. Let's see. I'm sure the person's probably screaming in the messages. Let me get to it. Come on. I know, guys. Rubber bumper. Rubber bumper, you hit it on the head there right away. 
Let's see here. What did I, what did I, did I, I already gave this. I didn't give the, oh, this was Sam's stuff. Okay. So Sam's stuff. So what, what I'm gonna have you do is tell me the three products that you want for Sam's and then we will uh, get it shipped off to you. So email me all your contact information at imunclechat at chilling with, at imunclechat at gmail.com and I'll get that sent out to you. Sam's product. And that was a uh, rubber bumper. All right, this is fun, guys. All right, man, I got 200 people on here. That's that's crazy. Okay, let's do something else. I'm running out of trivia stuff. I didn't think I was gonna do this many. Let me think here. Let me do another one on here. I need to get some people active that have purchased. So I'm going to drop this again. And that person, I'm gonna refund them. Let's see, how do you say his name? Jose B-A-R-R-A-G-A-N Baragna, Baragan, Baragan in Santa Maria. That's the town he lives in. Make sure you email me at I'm Uncle Chet. I will be reaching out to you as well. I'm gonna refund you basically your purchase price of what you bought on my website. And basically it's $29 and 55 cents. Okay. Let's give away these, uh, these Cletus ones. Let me think of a trivia here. Let me think of a trivia. These are the Cletus ones that have a little flaw on them. If you flat out hate the flaw and you don't want the hundred bucks, I'll, I'll get you something else, but we'll talk about that in, um, email. Okay. Uh, Hmm. This has to be an absolute answer. Let me think. Okay, all right, this is a fun one. Put your answer in the comment. First person to get it right wins. Um, how tall am I, foot and inches? Oop, I see a winner, hold on. I say that I am six foot with shoes on, but I'm technically, if a doctor measures me, I'm five foot 11. So that is Robert Downey. <laughs> Robert Downey, please email me, I'm Uncle Chet at gmail.com and I will get the Cleus flawed glasses sent out to you with the $100. All right, I'm gonna have a really big one. Since you guys have been so awesome on here and there's so many people logged in, um, I don't know what I'll do, but I'm like the last one, I hit the casino the other day, so I had this in my pocket. Let's see, what's this? Let's see how much this is, one, two. Let's do, let's do $500 cash as the last one, but I don't, I don't know that one yet. Well, I'll get to that. Since you guys have been so awesome on here, Let's throw that in there. And no, it's not fake money. I do have a lot of that laying around, but I did throw a ton of it on the track. Um, they were super irritated at the time, um, but I made so many jokes about it. And uh, I think I got so much attention for throwing money out at the Ranger race. I think uh, they like it now. So I think I might come up with some more stuff to throw out on the track. One guy actually in a Ranger, just to tell you guys that when I threw all that money out, um, I apparently got sucked up in somebody's intake and uh, he was pretty mad. So he's yelling at me in the pits, your stupid money prank, um, <laughs> your stupid money prank uh, took my truck out. And I was like, well, if, the, if a couple fake hundred dollar bills took out your truck, then uh, you didn't build that great of a truck for reliability and durability. So you should have put a filter on your air intake. Anyhow, um, okay, let's see. Let's see, let's see. We did these, we did these. Did I do these? Oh, I didn't do these cool ones yet. Let's do these ones. And since everybody's been so cool, I'll throw in a hundred bucks on this one. 
as well. So a hundred bucks and these ones, which I think are super cool. They're a little bit bigger guys. Let's see, are they bigger than these ones that I usually wear? So for comparison there, these are a little bit bigger. 100 bucks in these ones. All right, first person to answer. And I'm just gonna say, yeah, I'm gonna, let's make this one fun. It needs to come down to the exact number. And we'll pick a winner here. First person to comment. Um, <laughs> How much do I weigh? Pounds, all the way. So give me all the way down to, we don't have to go point the number, but somebody basically guess how much I weigh to the exact number, but you have to go down to decibels. All right, let me start looking in here. Let me look, guys. That first one was stinking close, real close. Let's see, that would've been funny. I mean, right off the, right off the hit, you hit it perfectly. I'm looking for an exact number here, guys. You guys are real, there's a lot that are close, 196. I haven't been 196 since college. Last time I got under 100, 200 pounds, uh, everybody thought I had cancer. Justin Slay, you were super close, bro. And Peter Noble, you were also very close. You guys are skirting around it. Come on, come on. I have not seen it yet. Let's see. Oh, 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 I see it. Somebody did it. Let's see. It starts to track on me. Okay. <laughs> Justin, you're paying attention. Justin Slay, 244 pounds. God, I'm so fat right now. I need to get down to like, I don't know, 225 would be nice, but I have this blown out knee and bad shoulders. I got all excuses in the world why I can't go to the gym. Justin, hit me up on my email. I'm Uncle Chet at gmail.com and I will... get that sent off to you. Uh, somehow show me, prove to me that, that you are who you say you are, that you won, maybe your name and the email, stuff like that. And uh, I will get those off to you. The sunglasses and the $100. So I'm gonna put the triple stripe. There's this triple stripe and the $100. Put that in there too. Guys, if you're still listening, you've won, make sure you put in there just to make sure what you actually won. Maybe if it's the sunglasses, say black with a reflective glass suns or the Cletus ones that had a flaw in them. Um, and then I think I did those ones, so I did all those. Okay, all right, let's do something fun here. Guys, people don't normally do this. I grabbed three of these. These are the mail-in for no purchase necessary. I'm gonna put them back in there so these won't be taken out of rotation for the uh, giveaway. But you know, if you wanna send in a postcard, I thought that was pretty cool. I've gotten a lot of these, um, hundreds of these. So I think, I just wanna give somebody that took the time to write that out uh, a chance to win something. So I'm gonna say, let's see here. Let's do, we'll just make it simple. We'll do a sticker pack and I'll do another $100. Okay, so sticker pack and a hundred bucks. This winner, I'll just pick this one. All right, I can't really show that. But I'll show it down here. Jordan, Jordan Baruby. He lives in, oh, Mass, New Bedford. And uh, I have all your information here, so I'll just be sending out 100 bucks and a sticker pack to you. So let me do the uh, postcard winner sticker. Oh, you know what? I haven't given away, guys. Gosh, I haven't given away all my merch yet. Hold on. I was like getting down to the end here, and I still have all my merch to give away. Okay, uh, sticker pack and 100. That's Jordan. Okay, cool. All right, I'm gonna have to probably watch my own stupid video to make sure I get these all perfectly right. All right, guys, I don't think I've messed up on here. You guys have been so awesome. Let me, let me read some of these first real quick here. Um, a lot of people ask me what I do for a living. Um, I have a video that I shot. I actually, I was a firefighter, paramedic here in Arizona. I 
I got out of college. That's what I always wanted to do. I left that. I did mortgages for a while. Then the economy crashed. Uh, but I did learn a lot from that. I learned how to make money. I lost everything. Started all over and uh, got my medic back. Got a job doing air ambulance rescue and uh, long distance transfers, guys. Like, uh, you're in Massachusetts and something goes wrong when you're on vacation, but you really live in Arizona. There's only one way to get you home and that's by jet transfer because let's say the hospital there isn't good enough or you need to get back to your uh, primary care physician here in Arizona. You just don't wanna be stuck out there. So I'm the guy that would facilitate that. I was a paramedic on those flights and I would actually fly you um, you know, home and, and, and do the insurance billing. I did really good with the insurance billing and that was kind of my, my breakout um, into my success now. And do, I do air ambulance transfers now um, solely in the country of Belize. I run that entire country as far as air ambulance goes. I do a lot of the ground ambulances. You've seen some of my ambulances on JH's channel and Garrett's channel. Um, I donated a couple ground units to them here very soon. And uh, basically that's how I, I do well. The, the, the crazy part is uh, I said, if I'm gonna make this kind of money and there's massive money in this industry, I'm not going to, uh, I'm not gonna balance bill anybody. I'm not going to, um, you know, if, if insurance doesn't pay, then I eat it. And I'm not gonna go after families. So I've never done that other than like threatening them if they didn't wanna turn over a big paycheck that an insurance company gave them. Um, I'm just trying to get paid on that stuff. They, they shouldn't have kept the check, that type of deal. But other than that, I've never gone after somebody to make them pay. And uh, that's kind of the deal. And also in the country of Belize, I also, um, I don't charge any of the locals for ground or air transfers. So if they fly on my plane or they are transported in um, my ground units, we don't send them a bill. So uh, that was kind of, you know, something I always wanted to do. And I just decided uh, the country of Belize was it. So um, that's where I work now. That's where I make most of my money. I'm actually needing to do another uh, charity thing. I might do that tomorrow on YouTube where I'll do the comment thing. So all the comments, as many as I can get, I'll donate to this other charity, like I did the Arizona Burn Foundation, uh, where I raised $18,000. That was crazy. You guys went bonkers on that. Um, and I picked a few winners from those comments too. So I, uh, I, I, that was, that was crazy. So I might do that one again for this other charity, um, that donates, uh, a lot of hospital supplies and whatnot. And I, I need another big shipment to go down to, uh, Belize. They really need another shipment. Uh, they haven't had one in a while. All right, guys. So let's look at my other merch guys. I, I can't even believe I almost forgot this stuff. <clears throat> Oh, and people ask me about donating to my charities. I don't really have that set up. I mean, down the road, I might, uh, if you guys want to get involved. But I think um, if I took money, it would be more, uh, how do you say, like celebrities and other big money people. If they want to, like, join in and do, you know, joint videos and stuff like that, uh, you know, maybe I get involved with them. I don't know. I just don't, I think that if, if I can handle the um, amount of donations this, the country needs and that type of stuff for the charities that I'm involved with and the ones that I own and run, uh, I usually just handle them myself and I usually just pay for all that stuff myself. So this is the new sweatshirt. Guys, this thing is super thick. Don't get this if you want a nice light sweatshirt. This is a nice, thick, heavy sweatshirt. You can find it on chillingwithchat.com. This one I love because it's like, um, thick and everything, but it'll stand the test of time. It's not like themed out. So, you know, like our side-by-side uh, -side bros shirt, that was just to raise money to pay for the side-by-side -side, uh, compound. This one you can wear forever. So let's, let's pick another, uh, let me think of another thing I can do here. Um, and I'll give this, I'll give this sweatshirt away. Um, let's see here, guys. Huh. Uh, gotta come up with like a simple question. Hmm. All right, this is kind of funny. All right, what is my favorite movie of all time? As you guys guess, if, I, if it doesn't get picked in here right away, I'll start giving some hints. I think the, the label of like the promotions for this 
Oh my gosh, I already saw it. Somebody already put it in there. Hold on. Let me make sure. Let me see here. This is super dark. Hold on. There we go. Um, do I do love Top Gun. I do love to uh, Tombstone, Rocky. Those are all freaking good. Avery Kitchens, Dumb and Dumber. Let's go. You win. Uh, Avery, make sure that you email me your size and your information at I'm Uncle Chet, and I will get uh, this sent off to you. I'm Uncle Chet at gmail.com, and I'll get this sweatshirt sent off to you. Thank you. That was that was pretty good, man. That was like right away. You guys guessed that faster than than the other. Let's see here. Mm. I think I gave away the shirt already. Let's get the other one here. All right. This is another awesome one. Same sweatshirt, same deal, thick, heavy. Really, really cool. How nice is that? I know, right? I love this sweatshirt. I, I'm so excited for this, and I can't wait to get a cease and desist. And I have to take it down. <laughs> so definitely buy these while you can at chillwithjet.com. I don't know how long I'm going to be able to sell these for. I have not been served yet. I mean, I haven't filed a lawsuit against anybody for copying me yet. That's what I mean. That's what I mean. All right, let me come up with a question here. Uh, ooh, 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 ooh. Okay, this one's going to be a little bit harder. Um, man, I saw a lot of them in there. Full Metal Jacket, Step Brothers. Gosh, you guys are pretty dang close. Those are all Ghostbusters, Boogie Nights, Godfather. Wow, you guys are really close. Okay, what was my favorite cartoon growing up? Now, remember, guys, I'm older, so these cartoons weren't on all the time. Um, it wasn't like all day long. So what was my favorite cartoon? There's a main character... There's a main character in there, and uh, he died in the first movie that they released. And I will say that was in 1984. Let's see here. Bugs Bunny. <laughs> I'm not that old. I hated those ones, man. They were not good enough. Let's see. DuckTales, dude, I did like DuckTales back in the day. That was one of my favorites, but not my favorite. One, that's funny. My Little Pony. My sister watched that one. I hated that one. Let's see. Ren and Stimpy. <laughs> Tom and Jerry. I can't believe nobody's put this other one I had in here. Uh, Beavis and Butthead. That, was a, that would have been close, but that's not it either. All right. I'm going to give a hint here, guys, because I don't see it yet. Let me get to the bottom here. If I see it and you already wrote it, I'll, I'll find it. So I have to scroll down slower than everybody here um, without this thing moving on me. Oh, somebody said it. Somebody said it. Stop moving. Stop moving. Stop moving. Here we go. Somebody said it. All right. Man, Bear, Chuck, Transformers. All right. Let me show you something too, guys, in my house. Let me show you. I'll take this up right, real quick. I wasn't planning on this. But let me take you around the house real quick. Check this out. This is how you know I'm single. <laughs> how cool is that? I had a guy out of Vegas. He makes these, and I had him do me these both custom like that. So, you know, you walk in this, like, you know, beautiful house, and it's all elegant. You know, you got this view of the lake. But, yeah, I got to have my Uncle Chet stamp on there. All right. Now I'm gonna say, let's do, uh, so let me write that down before I forget here. Man, bear, Chuck. Man, bear, Chuck. You got the um, Bull Chet sweatshirt. Make sure you hit me up at imunclechet at gmail.com and I will get that out to you. And make sure you put your size and your address and all that stuff. And, like, prove to me that you are Man Bear Chuck. And I will get you out the bullshit sweatshirt. Also, guys, I have... Let's see here. I'm going to pull this up on here. I have, uh, I have some cool bundles. So, let's see here. Hmm... Let's see. This first bundle... 
Yeah, let's do that. All right, I'm gonna give that bundle away to somebody. Let's come up with another one. Um, hmm. What is my favorite sci-fi movie? And I will say movie series. Sci-fi movie series. You will get the new merch bundle. <clears throat> All right, let me get back to my page where I can read through these real quick. Favorite sci-fi movie here. Oh man, before you guys, you said Thundercats. That's cool. That was another one of my favorite ones back in the day. Dirty Panda, I see you did guess it right, but unfortunately it was already guessed. Eric, you also did too. All right, let me get down here. So this is my favorite movie series. Oh, okay, I think I see a winner. All right, let me go here. I just wanna make sure it's the right person because it was kind of mixed in with my, okay. Well, geez, Justin Slay, you win again. <laughs> All right, Justin, that was, that was definitely not a TV show, so that wouldn't be confused. So Justin Slay, you, you win again, bro. So I'm gonna give you that bundle. And I'm also gonna pick the next person in line who, who guessed that as well. And that was Carl W. Carl W and Justin. You guys both are gonna win the bundle. So Carl W. Hit me up guys, tell me what you won. And he is slaying it, it's not fair. <laughs> but I'm gonna let him win, but I'm also gonna let Carl win. He was the second person to say Star Wars. Um, I would show you something really cool, but my daughter's lounging in that room, so I'm not gonna go disturb her. You could see a really cool painting I have. All right, let's do the other bundle. Let's see here. I have another bigger bundle. I'll pull that up right there, guys. This one's really expensive, but I mean, look at all the stuff you guys get. Uh, the shirts, uh, t-shirt, the hoodie, a, get a mystery shirt, chilling with Chet, dry mag, dry bag, uh, the stars and stripes, so calm, the glasses. I mean, that that is a pretty good deal. I mean, discounted and everything. I think that one you're making out pretty good at 180 bucks. But uh, if people bought that one, thank you. That like almost maxes you out for all the, you up to $200, you still get it one entry for every $5 and you max out, I think when you spend like 200 bucks or something. So uh, not a lot of people spend over that anyways. So, all right, uh, let me think of, let's see here. Let me think of the, the question for you guys. I gotta come up with something. Oh, I got a good one. I got a good one. I got a good one. All right, let me go back here. What was my first vehicle? If somebody just guesses that and knows it, uh, you better be my family or a close, close friend on here because that's kind of crazy. So what was my first vehicle? If you just name the, the, the model or the type of vehicle, it doesn't necessarily have to be, you know, Chevy, Honda, Ford or whatever. You can just say the name of it. And let me see if you guys are getting in here. Um... Let's see, K10, no, buy, K car, nope, Nova, nope, 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 peanut butter, <laughs> nope. Tempo, nope, Camry, pickup, F-150, no. Caprice, gosh, guys, I should have thought this out. Let me see here. I'm gonna give you a hint. If somebody already said it, I will find it, but I'm gonna give you a hint. Mullet. Oh, I got a winner. All right. It is High Octane Chef. You are the winner. It is a 70 El Camino. <laughs> yeah, a 70 El Camino. I wish I had a picture of it, guys. It was, it was dope. It was like a, 
uh, turquoise green, kind of like this, but not super turquoise, um, with a black top on it. It was a 350, 350 horsepower, four barrel. Love that car, but I actually got rid of it for a Honda Civic. I know, it's terrible, because I put two transmissions in it and I was just over it. It was way too much work. So high octane, you are gonna get that massive bundle. Congratulations, that thing is, that's a great bundle. I don't even give that one out to my friends. I give them other, other bundles. So high octane, you win the big bundle. Hit me up on imuclechad.com. Oh, guys, you guys have been asking about the jobs and stuff too. Uh, I'm gonna be giving this away here in a second, uh, the 500 bucks. Um, the, uh, you guys have been asking about the jobs and whatnot. So I am uh, filtering through all those. I kind of I kind of got knocked on my butt the other day when I wrecked and hurt my shoulder. That took me out for a little while, and uh, unfortunately, my my cameraman's moving away uh, out of town. So I don't know if I'm going to have to make some changes there. So I didn't want to jump on board and get a mechanic um, right away or a social media person. But I am filtering through those. I'm going to be calling you very soon to just uh, say thank you for sending it in at least. And then I'm gonna start talking to people and setting up some, some um, interviews. So just stay tuned to that. I, uh, I will be paying really well for the mechanic, the social media guy too, uh, or girl, whatever. Uh, if you have film experience, please uh, submit your application to I'm Uncle Chat. I really am looking forward to that because I need a lot of help there too. Everything's been growing so fast. Um, and guys, if you're not subscribed, which I'm sure you are, just make sure you go and subscribe to my channel. We got 86,000. I was hoping to hit a, a hundred by this year, but uh, didn't hit it yet. So um, I'm going to be uh, getting back to people right away on the, the, do, the job um, process. I might also be looking for uh, part-time camera work here. Maybe not so much editing, but camera work here too in the Valley. So please hit me up on that. And remember, uh, why I'm doing all this stuff, guys, is for the giveaway for the uh, Silverado. So every $5 you spend, or if you did the, uh, the mail-in stuff for the no purchase necessary, that'll get you entered in too. All right, $500 cash. Let's think of a good one for you. Man, I've consistently had over a couple hundred people for 45 minutes. Wow. I wish I could just give this out to everybody on here. Um, Let's see here. What would be a good one? Hmm. Okay, all right, here's a good one, guys. What is my favorite car that I own right now? So if you don't even know, follow the channel, you don't know, you can still guess cars. So the, of the cars that I own, what is the my most favorite? Okay. <laughs> Sorry, guys. <laughs> I already got a winner. <laughs> that was really quick. <laughs> All right, Mike. Mike M. I, I think you were the first person. I think you, dude, you were the first person to guess. Mike M., the Viper, fresh on your brain. Good, good call. You just won 500 bucks. Uh, guys, thank you for tuning in. Um, I should do more of these. I'll do, I'll try to do another one here soon and I'll just do like a Q and A and talk with all you guys. If I get a couple hundred people like this, I'll, I'll do this all the time and, uh, answer any questions you guys have about the channel and what I'm going to be doing. Please, uh, comment too on, on ideas. I'm going to read through all this stuff later on, uh, ideas for the channel. Um, you know, I'm going to be driving the lightning. If I get it back, if it re if they rebuild it, or if I get another one, I'll be driving that underwater, um, as the hundred thousand, view uh, 100,000 follower video. So that's pretty cool. So I just wanna say thanks guys. Um, and Mike M, you're gonna have to somehow prove to me that's you, that's gonna be a tough one because you have a very common name. Hit me up at uh, imuncleChet at gmail.com and I will make sure to get you this cash somehow. I might just Venmo you or something like that, that's easier. Um, but prove to me that you are this Mike M that won on here and guess Viper is my favorite car that I own. So guys, thank you. It's been a lot of fun, 40 something minutes. That's incredible. Remember go to chillingwithchet.com, check out my, my new merch, all that stuff. Uh, I, have, I have some of the best odds in the business, guys. I mean, this is, this is crazy. All this stuff that I have here, 
I mean, we're talking, you know, hundreds of thousands, low thousands of of entries. It's not a ton, guys. Like I don't have these a huge channel, so you have a really good chance of winning. Um, and uh, it's just chilling with chat.com. Follow the rules and all that on there. Thanks, guys. I'll see you next time.